Howdy, y'all. Welcome to Raiders in Review. I need I d- more. I don't remember. It doesn't matter if you look at me. <laughs> this is an opportunity to start again. This is you. This is just you. Do you understand me? Yes. I want you to give this your all. You are Clint Eastwood. And from that movie. Today is Western Day, so we're going to root toot and scoot those East Chamber sons of guns out of here. Speaking of root toot and scooting, let's scoot on over to this week's HOKO lineup. Hello, I am Owen. I'm here at the Raiders, where they're going to homecoming. And this week, they're going to be wearing clothes but different clothes for each day. And Monday is the day I'm wearing. I'm dressed as my favorite movie character, Remy, from Rats in Paris. Next is the Tuesday. These two gentlemen have decided that they are Tuesday. And Tuesday is Twin Day. Can you tell? Uh, now, gentlemen, uh, tell me, why are you, who, are you, who are you wearing, sirs? We are one. That's insane. I'm shocked. Shell shocked. Speaking of shells, Wednesday. Wednesday is full of pajamas. Why? Let's see what they have p- to pajama tonight. Wow. Like a rat. I've come from the sewers. Here to talk more about Wednesday, which is pajama day. Your pajamas. Why? That's pajamas. Now we're gonna Thursday. Huh. Thursday is throwback Thursday for different decades. Um, you're wearing old clothes. 1700s want their clothing's back. Are you gonna give them back, huh? You gonna give? You gonna give? You gonna give, you gonna give, them, give them back? <laughs> Hello, welcome to Friday. You're Friday. What are you doing for Friday? Uh, I'm just gonna go out support our Raiders growing a nation. Okay. Um, you're wearing Raider stuff. That's is that for Friday? Uh, God bless go Raiders. Love our Raiders. What are Raiders doing on Friday? I'm um, gonna go out, fight hard, win. Go Raider. Go blue. What are what are Raiders? Your mom. Sorry. Hello. That's all for this week. Now, if you will excuse me, I've gotta go back to the restaurant where Spaghetti Hair Man needs me to make French dip. Hooey! That was cooler than an Arctic saloon in December. Now for a fun little segment for all you literate folk. I wanted to talk to you a little bit about some of the books in the library. So we have some pretty popular series in here, including Divergent, Hunger Games, Harry Potter, and Twilight. But did you know that there are also some other companion books for them? So I'm going to talk to you a little bit about those. So the first one is Harry Potter and the Cursed Child, and this takes place 19 years after the Deathly Hallows, and it follows Harry and Ginny's son and Draco Malfoy's son as they try to right the wrongs that their parents did. So it's a pretty good book. It's based on a play J.K. Rowling and um, Jack Thorne collaborated to make it a play, so it's actually the script of the play. So you should check that out if you're a Harry Potter fan. The next one is the book four. So this is the story of um, four or Tobias. It's from his perspective. It starts two years before Triss ever gets to choose her faction. And this follows four as he leaves the faction that he was born into and chooses to go into another one. Pretty high, uh, pretty high energy, good intense book, especially if you like the Divergent series. Um, The next one is Midnight Sun. This is the story of the first Twilight book from Edward's perspective. So you get to see what his thoughts were on his budding and uh, complicated relationship with Bella. So this one was a pretty good read. You should check it out if you're a Twilight fan. And then the last one I've got for you is the Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes. So if you are a Hunger Games fan, you might want to check this one out. So this book takes place 64 years before the first Hunger Games novel. And it's when um, President Snow was chosen to be the first mentor in the game. So they decided to do this brand new experiment thing where um, they chose mentors for the tributes. So he was in the first group and he being from the Capitol was chosen to mentor district 12. And that was a big deal because district 12 was looked down upon. So he kind of had to struggle between helping his mentor uh, or helping his tribute to win versus his own opinions that were pretty biased against the district people. 
So check that out if you like the Hunger Games. Let me know if you've got any other questions. See y'all later. I feel more edumacated already. Next week is homecoming, so remember to show up and show out. Wait, Wait a minute. Yeah. Nice. Be here next Friday at 7 to support your Mighty Raider football team. Homecoming dance is tomorrow night, 8 to 11 at the pack. Get tickets at the door. Well, that's all for today, Raider Nation. Y'all have a rootin' tootin' weekend. Yeehaw! Okay, we're back. Uh, back on the streets, looking for another people to film or interview. Hey, you! Hey. Hey, you want to be in an interview? Sure, why not? Okay, yeah, you can just stand right there. Uh, what's your favorite anime? Huh? What's your favorite anime? JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Uh, why is that? Uh, because it's got a good story and it's really cool. 